don't know why Henry's looking away. Um, right, our sweet. We don't normally get something lovely and posh like this, to be fair. So I thought I would just a dark sweet. I don't know why. Go the entrance anyway. So in you come. Turn left. This is a storm in this place, actually. Very friendly. Turn left. Can't. Haven't figured the lights out that strongly in there. And a dirty, great big. There were. Thank you, Henry. Massive walking shower. Walk out. Seating area. Kitchen, freezer, ting, all the stuff that I'm not going to need apart from a kettle. Seating areas and desk and stuff and walking along. Ah, again, Henry. Ah, oh, can't do it. There we go. Out onto balcony to look at ooh, the Bellagio or wherever that is. Fountains, very nice. There you go. Uh, up to the other side, um, which is pretty cool, got to say. And then, oops, into our room. It's, just, it's kind of ridiculous when we first walked in. Oh my goodness me, and it kind of just kept going. Um, I've never been in a hotel room really where you could turn two corners to have to um, actually see your room. So there you go, your thing. And then, Come through, bedroom, walk-in closet there. Thank you very much. And then uh, a proper bathroom, because the other was, well, just not a proper bathroom. Uh, Japanese soaking bath, apparently. Obvs. And the toilet, yeah, clearly. His and hers. Mm -hmm. And another shower. Uh, although this one, um, this one you can sit in. Clearly, because that's what you need to. So yeah, very, very, very lucky. Um, it's taken us 24 hours to figure out, but we got to order the kettle from um, room service, but we've just spoken to guest services and she's very nice and that's nice. So we're just about to do that when we start drinking our great, not have to go out asking people on the, um, the strip, do they do tea and not get turned away all the time.